Hey guys, welcome back to the Struggleville YouTube channel. This morning I went to a garage sale that had a ton of tools. You can see this big old stack here. And it was two like card tables, like four foot by four foot card tables, just full of tools. And I didn't get the chance to go through all of them, but I saw some nice name brand stuff in there. So I offered them $100 for everything. And uh, that's what I paid. So we're going to go through all this, sit back, grab a beer, take a bathroom break, whatever you got to do. Uh, this is going to take a minute to go through all of it. I'm going to try and organize a little bit as I go because I'll pull out the stuff I like, the stuff that I want to keep, and then the rest of this is eventually going to make it to the, the eBay store. So, so as we're going through, let me know what you think. $100 for all of it. I know there's a little bit of Taiwan stuff, but there's a lot of vintage stuff and name brand, and I think it'll be good. Move so I can actually see the camera here. You can see they had it priced for $15. Uh oh, a little no name ratchet. Not good. Not a good start. Uh oh. No name ratchet that's locked up. Where, where do you put the broken tool at? We'll put it down there. No mark on the extension there. Made in Taiwan. Not good. A little swivel guy. Let's see, that is... Oh, that's a Williams. So that's actually a decent item. Williams USA. Let's see. Made in Taiwan tools. I'm going to start throwing them right there. You got a whole little socket rail. I would keep this set together if it was all the same, but with the ratchet being broke, yeah, maybe we'll still keep it together. Made in Taiwan, CRV. That one doesn't have the same markings on it, so it's definitely not all one set. Taiwan. Alright, these are made in Taiwan tools. We'll leave them right there. Let them sit. I think I might be paid $15 for that, though. We got its brother. This one had $17 on it. Oh, I've seen a ratchet that looks a lot like that before. This one says chrome vanadium. Did I say it? I don't know. At least this ratchet works. It's got the little thumb wheel on it. No markings on the extensions. Nothing there. Made in Taiwan on the sockets. One looks a little bit different. Nope, still made in Taiwan though. Let's see, it says 22 piece quarter inch drive socket set. Alright, we got two made in Taiwan sets. We're gonna leave this one together. I'll go back on a garage sale or something all by itself. This set they had listed for 20. Run out of room on this bench. They loved their Taiwan tools. This ratchet works. Let's see. Taiwan. HM Taiwan. Taiwan. Japan. Tartan. What the hell is tartan? Who knows what a tartan is? Come on. It's not going to focus. Tartan. I guess that's different. No marking on the extension. This is a KMC Taiwan. 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 We're going to get to some other non Taiwanese tools here in a minute. Here's a Thor Thorson. Thorson 916. Made in USA. Seems not going to focus for shit. You guys just have to take my word for it. So the Thorson's good. We'll put that in a separate container. Taiwan. Taiwan. Hey, Taiwan. And more Taiwan. All 
Alright, this one was listed for $12. Oh, I'm thinking more Taiwan stuff. Kind of a cool old graphic, though. It says Made in Japan on the graphic there, but these are Taiwan sockets. You gotta check them all. They might throw in like we had that Thorson in the one. Here's a Sparta. Made in USA. You can see it's a Sparta. Spark plug socket. First it said SP socket. I'm like, well, what brand is SP? Ha! Spark plug it's saying. Okay. Companion. Made in China. Taiwan. It's a little driver here. It says it is a Bonnie. There you go. That'll go off to the side. Taiwan's Japan. Let's see what it's say. Uh, I'm just Japan. Garage is creaking and groaning. If you can hear it. Let's see. So far, all Taiwan's. Here's an Ace. Made in Taiwan still. This has a brand name on it. We'll put it off to the side. The Ratchet works. No brand name. Bad sign. Probably made in Taiwan. And we're coming in like a lion, but we're gonna go out like a like a wait. We're coming in like a a lamb. We're gonna go out like a lion. Whatever it is, it gets better. It's allied. Made in Taiwan. So 10 millimeter, hell, I should just keep all the 10 millimeters, even if they are Chinese. So Stanley, made in Taiwan, but it's another 10. Eh, I'll put that off the side. Keep the 10, so you lose them in a minute anyways. All right, that's a Taiwan case. Oh, those don't fit like that. Enough for government work. Got another green case. This one they had listed for $22. And this one actually says SK Tools on it, so that's a good sign. We have a SK Tools Ratchet USA S45170 3 8 drive. Yeah, that's good. I like that. And it's actually an SK socket. So we got 3 8 7 16 9 16 half inch, and a 5 8 another half inch, 3 8 You can probably sell this all as a set. Even if it's not all the original, put in the model number 716 on that one. A little extension. Yep, that's SK2. Nine sixteenths. Eleven sixteenths. Eleven thirty seconds. That's a popular size right there. Five sixteenths. This one's a little beat up. Looks like three eighths to me. Seven sixteenths, half inch. What is that? Thirteen sixteenths, three quarter, 
7.30 seconds. It's another one I use all the time. Oh, this one don't go with it. Throw that somewhere else. Yeah, throw it there. 9.30 seconds. So let's say 8 sixteenths. I can't say 3 sixteenths. Like, what the hell? That can't be right. Okay. And a quarter inch. All right, not too bad. So they're all SK. Got the ratchet and extension with the box, even if they're not all the original sockets. It's a nice little set put together on eBay. It could be forever before this stuff actually gets listed because I have such a, a backlog of things. Okay, come on now. Oh, it's this side. Well, we like that one. This one's priced at $23. Oh, man. It had such potential. It looked like a nice ratchet, but no brand on it. that trend well, you can't read whatever it said at one time here we have uh, is that B in the uh, is that Bonnie when they got that B is that the logo I wish my camera would focus better Anyways, it's an inch and sixteenth made in USA socket. Plum? Is that with the little upside down triangle? Is that really an upside down triangle? I don't know. I don't know if there's an up and a down to a triangle. Anyways, one inch. It's not bad. Let's see. Back to the Taiwan tools. We mix in a few Taiwans. There's an SK. Three quarter and the Taiwan tool. Five eighths SK. A rigid made in USA. Eleven sixteenths. Japan. Let's see. Chrome alloy. 916's USA, but it doesn't have a brand. And Challenger, half inch, made in USA. Another Challenger. So we'll put these unmarked and Taiwan tools back in the box. Try to knock these completely off the desk or the bench. This one's only listed for ten bucks, so we got not high hopes. Another cool little graphic, even though it's a little destroyed. It says Royal Tools over here, 1978. Back to Taiwan. Taiwan ratchet, New Taiwan, quarter inch, here's a Napa socket, extension no name on it. I'll let you know when anything is uh, better than made in Taiwan or made in China. I think with a brand name on it. Japan. Another 
pan. Not getting out of bed for that either, though. Got a bolt with a nut. All right, this box is uh, no bueno. No more. Shut up, garage. It's possessed. So they had $20 on this guy. At least it's a nice little set. Made in USA is a good start. It is a Husky, although you can just barely make out a few letters. See the KY? You have to take my word for it. It's a Husky made in USA, so that's good. Case is broken. That's fine. Now, I don't see any markings on the extension, but you would hope that these are all together. And nice and clear on that one. It definitely says Husky. Good ratchet. Now, this extension says Husky right at the bottom. So this one maybe was a replacement. Yeah, they're different. So this guy... Probably does not belong. Which of these things is not like the others? Got the Husky spark plug socket. So this first one's Husky starting at 3 8 inch. And then we got a Cobalt. But it's made in USA, 7 16 yeah, I'll have to organize these damn things later more. Duracraft. Duracraft Pro. Another Duracraft. Husky, 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 Husky. Who knows, I might be able to finish out the set with other tools in this little lot. Husky, Japan, Husky, Made in USA, Husky, 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 and Husky. So, I mean, it's nearly complete. Hopefully we can find the other pieces that we're missing. We just had a block of drill bits, which I'm not going to go through or do anything. He had $10 on it. Maybe I'll just throw it in my garage sale and see if anyone offers anything for it. Got tray of sockets. Another drill bit that fell out. Oh, it fell out because it don't fit in any of the holes. There we go. Okay, let's see. They wanted two dollars for these sockets, and it looks like every one of them was made in Taiwan. So the little socket rail might be worth more than the sockets themselves. Wanted six dollars for these sockets. It's like all Taiwan. So for here we have oh, CV Japan. All trade, which okay. All right, let's dig through these things and see what we get. We got a Sears made in Taiwan though. Bench top. Powercraft. 
Powercraft, Powercraft. Is that the Montgomery Ward brand? I don't think so. I don't know. Powercraft will pull off to the side. Allied. Japan. Japan. Taiwan. It's an Ace Hardware, but Taiwan. Taiwan. Three eighths. We are just barely getting started, by the way, if anyone's keeping track at home. It's an Allied. Good wrench. GM Good Wrench. Three eighths. Oh, okay. Something to look up, pay attention to, see if we get more of them. Taiwan. So let's say. FM USA. It's another Powercraft. Thorson again, quarter inch drive. Taiwan. Another power craft. Come on. Another Powercraft. I think we might pull out a whole set of those. Another Japan and Taiwan. It's an, uh, I was going to say it's an SK, but now I don't see a... It just says steel. It looks like SK's design, kind of. Taiwan. There's a Husky. Just has the number nine. <laughs> it's the only thing, only marking on it. That's quality there. Don't put the MM. Don't uh, don't do nothing. There's no one else. I want to say it's called Plum. I'm gonna call it Plum. I'm gonna do that, and we're gonna find like a hundred of them. And be like, hey, that's what you say. That's what it's called. Well, they didn't even use a damn letter in the middle of it, huh? I'm supposed to make up what it's supposed to say. Let's see, Greystone. Never even heard of Greystone. There's another Husky, even though it's kind of beat up. Some of these rusty ones, maybe I'll throw them in some of that. Oh, what's that crap called? I have it down in my basement, a bucket of it. Rust be gone. That's not what it's called, but you let it soak in it, and it evapo rust. That's what I'm thinking of. From the Taiwanese, Taiwanese. Oh, here we go. Industro. That's a good one. USA. And then no other brand marking. Unfortunate. This says Powercraft. Another Husky, USA. I wonder when did Husky start sending everything to China and Taiwan? FM. I'm sure it's something you could find out to kind of date how old the sockets are. It just says Chrome, Chrome Vanadium. It's a 
exactly how you say it. It's going to be another word I mispronounce. People bitch about. You got that wrong, dumbass. Getting a big old pile of these Taiwan loose sockets now. There's just a Sears Taiwan still. Just gotta make my hundred bucks back. Well, I'd like to make actually a little money off them, but you know, half the fun is digging through it. Does that say? Well, there's a power craft. And the last one in this one, Sears Taiwan. So all the Taiwans back in the tub. Okay, Taiwan sockets in a tub. We got it. We got a place to put them all now. this tray so I don't know what that is that was in there those arrows I don't know. Who cares? okay everything in front of this cardboard was 50 cents a piece and everything in back he wanted a dollar a piece so as we go this is uh Indestro it's a good one Taiwan That was not. Oh, the ones kind of falling off. I just saw the nine. I'm like, the no. So, you know, anything that goes that way, Taiwan or Japan or China, China. We have uh, Armstrong USA. Let's see if we can get the. No. It focuses in on my hand perfectly. Just won't focus on anything else. Another Indestro. No markings on the adapter. Jeez. So rusted up at the engraving, you can't read what it says. Just sprinkling enough good sockets so they buy it and fill the rest with Japan and Taiwan. That's cool. What does that say? Blackhawk. Blackhawk USA 5 8 drive. See? Another Indestro, USA. All trade. Thorson. Definitely going to need a bigger Taiwan socket holder here. Uh, Powercraft. I'll take those off to the side. I need a second uh, Taiwan socket holder. What was this one? Yeah. All right. Zoom normal program. Oh, 
about Sears. I hadn't realized that Sears had, you know, like their own brand, not Craftsman tools, but just Sears tools. I have a pair of channel locks that are the same thing. I just I never realized that were to be the case. This says USA on it, but without any other markings. I might as well just go on the Taiwan pile. What the hell logo is that? Okay, who can help me out on that? CTC? Is that what it... I know we gotta put that in the other pile because I don't know what CTC is. It doesn't say Taiwan, so. Thorson. Sid Chrome AF. Jeez, I have no idea what Sid Chrome is either. I don't think that's the brand. I think that's the material. Another Powercraft. 11 sixteenths. Master Mechanic, USA. Well, it's USA, so we'll throw it on the other side. It's all shot to hell. You notice how these old Taiwan tools look? Hmm. It's almost like they weren't manufactured as good as the other ones. Sentech. Is that the same? Harbor Freight Sentech? Their Centec is like electronic stuff. Good wrench GM. This says, oh Jesus, another one I never heard of. Um, I don't even know how to pronounce this. Awatana Tools. Awatana Tools, USA. Come on, you son of a bitch. Off the side, so I gotta do a Google search. Thorson. What am I gonna do with all these Taiwan tools? Nobody wants Taiwan tools. I don't know if I can get rid of them in a garage sale. Alanite. What the hell is Alanite? I never heard of that one either. In Japan, uh, I don't think it's worth it. We haven't seen any other ones of that. Well, this one's new too. That says T T R U T E S Truths. Is that? I don't know if you can see, it's really faded. Focus on something up close, you bastard. No, I don't know. That's what I think it said. And tat. T A T. Tat. Oh, Taiwan. Screw it. I don't care what it says. Okay, now the back row. These are supposed to be a buck a piece. I don't think there was any rhyme or reason why. Right, we need another Taiwan socket area. Need more spark plug sockets. All trade. Nothing. Throw that out. And then we have a new Taiwan sockets area. So now Taiwan sockets can go in there.
And everything that's not Taiwan will go in this thing. Put, oh, this is the broken ratchet. Pray throw that out. You wanted to see more sockets, right? I think I heard you say you wanted more sockets. So here's a Husky ratchet. He wanted $8 for it. Half inch drive. Seems to work. Maybe. There we go. That's not bad. Right. Oh shit. We got a something here. Let's check it out. We got a SK 7 8 Got an SK 13 16 um, SK 3 quarter. SK 11 16 Craftsman. Come on, man. Why'd you put these? Oh, this is the old. No, is this, the, this is the old Craftsman, though. If you look at the logo, we well, can tell about the socket, but usually these Craftsman things, between the logo and the code on it, you can date them, more or less. Looks like it's BE. BE series. A lot of the plating or whatever's off it, so a lot of people who buy these things as collectibles care about the condition, so it's anyways there's another SK. And I don't know what this is. Thorson. Alright, which that's a decent brand. Destro. Holy Jesus. Oh man, where did I leave off? There's a Crescent. And I think we started with that SK. So those are good sockets. We'll just put those a whole little nifty string of them together. And there's another one. How much did he want for these? He wanted at first $20 and marked them down to $15. Okay, let's try this again. Got an SK. Got a Williams. Got another SK. Yeah, let me bring you up here. I didn't realize you guys are so low. Oh, let's see. That is upside down. And it says Ward's Master Quality. Those are a Bonnie. Bonnie and Clyde. A fleet. What the hell is that? that? Just says fleet. Not farm and fleet. Not fleet and farm. Just fleet. And uh, another SK. A Craftsman. Eleven sixteenths. It is a VV. Let's say VV. VV series. So some uh, pair together. SK and a Bonnie. Those are big sockets, so that's nice. Okay, as we continue on, we get a Taiwan socket that was listed for a buck. Why would anyone pay a dollar for a Taiwan socket? And then we have another Husky. Why a dollar twenty-five for that? And a Mustang. Huh, that's different. I don't know if I've ever seen a socket that said Mustang on it. Made in the USA. Made another. What was this? A, it's a another Indestro socket. And a Dayton. Dayton. Master. Just says Master. No, oh, Speed. Speedmaster. Okay. Doesn't say Made in USA, but maybe. I probably would say it if it was. 
Should I don't know Speedmaster. We'll have to look it up. What's the, oh man, we tied up one socket. Look at that. Just tied up one. I only wanted a buck for it though. And Destro. Half inch. I can't believe he actually took the time to price each individual socket. Oh, he had $100 worth of work in this. That's a Bonnie. Oh, there's more stuff under here. Oh, I'll be damned. I didn't even take... Okay. Taiwan. Taiwan. It's another Husky. Hopefully we can finish out that set that we had. SK. Truecraft. Japan. Japan. What does that say? Promate? There's another one of those. Speedmaster. SK. What's SK stand for? No idea. Is that B? Is that Bonnie? I still... Is that B for Bonnie? Maybe. Maybe not. Another Husky. You can actually read that one. What the hell does that say? Penens Corp? And then this corp. Another Craftsman. BE series. Another Craftsman BE. Craftsman V series. 11 sixteenths. Alright, I'm not even... This, you cannot pronounce this word in English. Vielchek. Vulchek. Vulchek. In USA. Oh, it's definitely not a USA name. Uh, this one doesn't have a brand. It says D-I, maybe. 11 sixteenths. But no brand. Doesn't mean you're good. Another Craftsman V-Series. 11 sixteenths. Craftsman V, 11 sixteenths again. Powercraft. Really shot out, but it's in Destro. Noise is actually a tree branch hitting the side of the garage. Yeah, I should trim it. Craftsman V, E. And a Husky. 13 sixteenths. Let's see what was down in the bottom thing. Hell, it was sitting on that table with the one on top of the other and all the sockets in there. I didn't look down here. That is a... What does that say? Judd. Judd. It's a one-inch Judd. It's on the back. Patent applied for is all it says on the back. I want to keep these little guys. I need that stuff. This thing's all corroded and shit. I don't see any markings on it. Oh, wait. Would it say mall? Would it make sense for it to say M-A-L-L? -L? This one don't say nothing. Adjustable. Well, yeah, I knew that. That's all it says. Okay. I'm not a table room here. He's going to come off the side. Needed more sockets, right? Got some ratchets in here, too, but I think it's the scratch and dent pile. So we start out with the. Uh, Yasco? Asco? E A S C O. Three eighths drive. It's got a little thumb wheel on it. Oh yeah, and it works. It works. 
Yeah, baby. I don't know if that's any good, but at least it works. Does it say where it was made? USA. Good. Got another little... Oh, the Powercraft Ratchet. Cool. Go with the sockets. Oh, you saw it. Nah, it's not worth my time to dick around with, and that one don't work. Another Taiwan TAT. T A T. Throw away the Taiwan sockets. No markings. Not a good sign. Uh, a little custom jobber, maybe? Works, but no name. Not very good ratchets in here, no markings. Nothing on that one. Okay. Let's, uh, let's see. Action. Manufactured USA. Action. Well, we can look it up. I don't know what brand name Action is. A lot of these are tied on our strings again. He wanted $5 for this. This little roll. Uh, Master Mechanic, Bench Top, Master Mechanic, Bench Top, Globe Master, Taiwan, Japan, Taiwan, Bench Top, and what does that say? Taiwan. This one we are priced at geez, 525. We have all trade, all trade, Thorson. Oh man, why do we put one Thorson in there? I gotta open this thing up. All trade, all trade, all trade. I don't have a knife on me. Son of a bitch. Oh man, he used some good stuff there. Mm. Oh, fuck it. Thorson, you're going to in the Taiwan pile now. Let's see, we got a Sears, but it's made in Taiwan. Another Sears. Sears. It'll all be the same. Sears. Japan. Throw one Japan in there, fool. Taiwan. And another Sears. They can all just go there. We have Taiwan, Japan, Truecraft, Truecraft, junk. See, a craftsman extension, even though it's kind of beat up. Might be able to do something with that. Trade it in for a new one, maybe. Uh, can't read anything on that. Guy. I'm telling you guys, it was a lot for a hundred bucks. Even if it is three-quarter Taiwan. Sears, Taiwan, Oh man. Okay, it's a Stanley, but it's a Stanley Workmaster USA. Well, I want the damn USA out of there. Mm, jerks. A Bonnie, we want that one. Taiwan, Taiwan. I want two of them out of here. Where am I grabbing a knife? You bastard. Well, I'll put them over here and I'll, here, I'll put it in here. So I got a separate pile. Alright, here we got Master Mechanic USA. Probably hold on to that one. Walden. How about a Walden? Walden. Artisan USA. Different one. Okay, 
can't even read that. It says USA on it, but that's all I can read. Another fleet. Another fleet. Another fleet. To be separated at birth. Or at death, I guess. Oh man, what the hell? These first. So he wanted three bucks for these. Start out with a fleet. Japan. Oh, Allied. Taiwan. 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 And Japan. Well, damn it, I want this one fleet. Oh, this is wire. I can do that. I can figure that part out. My competency may be low, but it's not that low. Oh, we'll only drop the one though. Well, let's put the tag back on it. We'll just leave it there for my garage sale and maybe someone will want to pay three dollars for these. Well, and the tag ripped. Well, that was a nice idea while it lasted. Shit, where'd my socket go? Alright, moving on. Taiwan, Taiwan. 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 Man, I'm gonna need a drink break here in a minute. Give me a damn something strong. Uh, these all look pretty bad. Okay, all Taiwan, and we have a dented ass tin if anyone needs it. Few more sockets available here. I like the little I don't know, socket rail though. Let's see, that's a Bonnie. That's a Bonnie USA. Bonnie, Bonnie, Bonnie. Oh, and they stuck a craftsman in there. So your first one, two, three, four, five are all Bonnies. We have a craftsman there, a craftsman there, craftsman, Bonnie, craftsman. He wanted twenty dollars for that rail. It's actually pretty good. I like that one. Okay, another one on a rail. We got deep wells. He wanted 15 for it. We have craftsman, craftsman. I don't know what this thing says. What the? What's that? Well, it's Taiwan, so I'm going to take it off. But read that. It's M E T R I N C H. Metrinch? Metrinch? Hell, I don't know. Anyways, throw it there. Then we go back to Craftsman, 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 and they're all USA, so. Of course, all this stuff is old. None of it's new, so. I might be able to fill in any pieces I'm missing in my Craftsman stuff. This rail we had listed for 12. We have an Ace Hardware. Have a SK. Now this rail is going to be have to be split up pretty bad. Taiwan. Powercraft, not bad. It's going to be. Uh, let's see, that's a Bonnie. Proto. That's the first Proto we've seen. Kind of beat up, but you can kind of see it says Proto there. Industro and what does that say? Uh, snap on. I'll be damned. Sons of bitches, we got one in there. Got a snap on. All right, now we got another big rail. It was listed for $19. We got Craftsman, 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 Craftsman. It's a Craftsman. 
Craftsman. So Williams. I think we've had at least one of those so far. Maybe not. Craftsman. This is a Thorson Craftsman. Craftsman. These are all made in USA. This is, um... Why does it have the series on it? What the hell? I don't, I don't know. It doesn't say. And another Craftsman. That bugs me. Why doesn't... They always have, like... Like now I think it's AG or AF or some shit. Those V-series ones we saw the BE ones. This doesn't say anything. I need a Craftsman Historian. Got another rail. The rails are easier to go through. Craftsman. This one's V-series Craftsman. 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 I probably shouldn't use the word series. I'm saying it's not a series. It's an edition. Suck my ass. Craftsman, 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 craftsman. So that whole rail was craftsman, and he wanted fifteen dollars for it. One more rail, then we're back to strings that are annoying to try and figure out. Uh oh, Taiwan, 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 Taiwan. 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 Oh, wants Taiwan. Oh, quarter inch driver. No markings on it though. Go with the Taiwan sockets, I guess. Let's see, we wanted two dollars for this. No marking. Malaysia. You don't see a Malaysian socket every day. Oh, damn it! There's a power craft in there. I'm gonna take that apart. Taiwan. All trade. Malaysia. 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 To be taken apart. Got a Taiwan. 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 Mm, all Taiwan. Bench top. Taiwan. Bench top. Thorson, damn it. Japan. Of course, one decent socket. Malaysia. All trade. Malaysia. Taiwan. Malaysia. It's another one of those FM sockets, which I don't really know what that is, but I'll have to take it out and look. More Malaysia. Taiwan. All trade. Taiwan. Taiwan. Malaysia. Taiwan. Bench top. All Taiwans. Duracraft. I don't care about Duracraft. What does that say? Taiwan. seen Malaysian sockets before. This guy just has a like every one that was ever produced. I'll trade. No, they're all bad. Okay, let's see. Taiwan, Taiwan. Oh, there's a craftsman. Sneaking in there, huh? I'm gonna get that craftsman out of there. Let's 
Lance Craftsman V. 1130 seconds. Maybe not the ideal size. Jesus, come on. Kmart, Japan. We're almost done with the uh, this bundle. Oh, there's another craftsman. Three eighths. And a Vulcan. I'll take that one out too. Another craftsman, although somebody Looks like did some customizing on that. Come on, fool. No customization. This says made in USA, it has a number, but can't see anything. And another husky, so that's gonna have to get taken apart. Another drill bit. I'll throw that in with these drill bits over here. Just became more valuable. Okay. Ooh. Bench top. There's a Sears. Another Sears. Jeez, that thing shot out. I don't even really care what it says. Sears. No marking. Nothing. Taiwan. Taiwan. Master Mechanic. Master Mechanic. Master Mechanic. What does that say? Master Mechanic. Master Mechanic. You say we change it up a little bit. We'll move on to hammers. They look pretty rough. Another candidate for my evapo rust, and I don't see any markings on this guy. Sounds like someone's here. Okay, that's over there. Whoa, scrub from this end. And another claw hammer. Hmm. Can't read that either. We'll throw these in Evapo Rust and I'll do an update video and see if we can read anything afterwards. So I can't see anything on that either. Nope. I've done in the past, especially if the handles are bad, just take the heads off them and so just the hammer heads. That's a craftsman at least. Put that in here. This guy is broken. About garbage. And then we have this one without a mark. This is a haul, boys. A haul. Got a little crescent wrench by Utica. He wanted six dollars for it. Adjustable wrench. Not a crescent wrench. That's a trade name. 
Crestoloy. Crest Crestoloy. Crestoloy. Crescent Tool Company. Jamestown, New York. Nice and smooth. Doesn't look bent. I like it. A couple of wrenches here. We got the Craftsman. Oh, Jackass put his fucking name or initials or whatever that is. And letter and some numbers on it. That sucks. Hate when people do that. China. China tool be gone. Fix and save. I just like the name of it. Made in Japan. Ah, it's not going to fit in my bucket. Damn it. Here. Some Taiwan tools. Taiwan tools. Get out of here. Another craftsman. Be able to clean it up a little bit. It'll be all right. VV. Still look good. Well, it's a craftsman, though. Nine sixteenths. Another craftsman, three eighths. Craftsman, seven sixteenths. No maker marks on that guy. Oh, I can't read the price of what he wanted for it either. Oh man, someone took a chunk out of that craftsman. Look at that. Hit it with the grinder or something. Nine sixteenths. And then we have a. What's underneath that? I don't know what that says. It's old. Kind of beat up. No. Yeah. Okay, next. Got a Phillips screwdriver. Daisy. It's a daisy. Hmm. A lot of space here. No markings on that one. A little wood handle nut driver. It is a I can read. Spin tight. Spin tight. That's cool. It's a spin tight if you've never seen one. I don't even know where I put things now. It's just a big mess. Handle's kind of beat up. Get it out. Not turn crust. Screwdriver, Taiwan. Malco. Didn't say. Nah, I'll throw it right here. Made in USA. It looks like a. It says Victor on it, but that's one of those tire reamers things, right? Is that what it's for? Uh, I can't imagine it's worth anything. Another one of these, made in Taiwan. Slip joints says Forge Steel USA. But I don't see anything else on it. No, that's it. It's too bad. Yeah, we'll put them over off to the side. If I get a couple different pliers that are USA, we can put them together even without a brand on it. Let's see. Hong Kong. Genuine leather. 
Rebecca. Three sixteenths. Okay, cool. Put that in the keeper pile. And do not see any marks on that. tub to put stuff in. A bottle of crap that was in the bottom of it. I don't know, for $100 I think I got screwed. <laughs> Sorry. People say you got all junk. Uh, these all say Malaysia on them. And it's Buffalo. Malaysia. Well, keep as much of the set together as we can. And they put seven dollars on it. Jeez, I'd be happy to get two dollars for it. Let's put these. Got a big ass Bonnie. Oh, dude, dude. So was that broken or was it on purpose? Was someone trying to slide it in there? Hmm. Got one of these ratcheting guys. No marks and kind of junky, so. Right here. India. Made in India. I don't have a new uh, Taiwan tools bucket. Once this is empty, I guess I will. The Suntech, Japan. Uh, Gador, Jador, Gador. I've had a couple of these before. Doesn't mean I know how to say the name. Another Japan. It said True Craft on it. Taiwan. Ace Hardware. Truecraft, Japan. Made in USA and no marking on it. Hmm, that's too bad. I'll still put it over here. There's another one of these action ones. I always saw something said action on it earlier. Oh man, it's broken. Broke. Upland Forge? I have never heard of Upland Forge. Well, we gotta keep that because you gotta look it up. Powercraft. It's a husky. Barcalo? Barcalo? Buffalo. True Craft Japan. Jeez, can't even read this thing. It says USA. There's a price tag on it. Made in USA. No, nope, all I can read is made in USA and select steel. Oh, I should throw it over here. That was a cool looking one. Drop Forge, made in USA. Select Steel. has an M right in the middle. I'm assuming it's supposed to be an M. Select Steel, Japan. No, Quality Steel, Japan. It's quality. Made in USA. Forge Select Steel. It just says 729 up there. These ones are all tie wrapped together for some reason. We have a Germany Veda. Vedemonium? Vedemonium. 
I'm assuming that's the type. That can't be the brand. It's going to be like the type of material. Drop forged. Can't read this one. It says made in USA though. No, oh, this one I can't read either. The last one. Armstrong. So I'm going to take those apart. Another made in USA without a name brand. Forged USA. USA, no name brand. Brand name? No name. Vetchin? Vichek. All trade. Forged select steel, made in USA. I wish these things had a. Is it Williams? Taiwan. India. What's that? Bidor. G Dore. Is that a oh good. I'm glad we had something with a blade in it while we were digging through things because that's that's cute. I like that. Get that thing out of here. I wish I could get the blade to back up. Come on, there we go. Come on, go back. Go back. Get out of here. Germany chrome. Vanadium, but it doesn't say a brand. Cool if it said like West Germany. Hey, anyway. Um, Trump Forged. Trump Forged, no markings. It's another Armstrong. Century, Japan. Pair of scissors. Wiss, USA. It's actually a nice little find. Clean them up a little bit, maybe. Billings. It's going to be a USA brand. That VL check thing again. VL check. Wool check. Wool check. This is USA on the wall. Is that even? Is that a thing? Come on. Come on. Oh, you're a jerk. It looks like crap, though. No. Let's see what happens. West German. Made in Western Germany. That's cool. We'll keep it just because it says made in Western. Five eighths China. India. Doesn't have any name on it though. Trump Forged made in USA. Better built. <laughs> Some of these I wonder if you could sell them just because the name on it and someone would want to keep it for some reason. You want a better built Japan wrench? This uh Barcaloy Barcaloy. Barcaloy Buffalo. I don't know. Most of these people who use names that are easier to say and know. It's a Thorson. Oh, it was made in Taiwan, though. Well, screw it. I'm keeping their tools. Jeez, this thing is beat. Forge in USA, but that's too far gone for me. 
No markings. It's old enough it's gotta be made in USA though. I would imagine. Italy. Still can't do that. Finny? Person's name. Oh, it was a proto, you jackass. Damn. Proto. Quality Steel, Japan. One of those Forged USA. High Test, Japan. Another Finny. So is it the Proto? Oh man, it's another good one. Electrolyte. Nice to get sets out of these, but it sure don't seem like we're getting sets. West Line. Hmm, that's interesting. It looks like the other ones, but... The other ones did not say Westline. What the hell brand is this? Made in Spain. Different. We haven't seen Span Spaniard. Spanish tools. Palmera. Popular mechanics. Oh, you don't you fall. Another Sentec. Of these little that they group together it's kind of a cool thing and it's made in usa we'll keep that so it as a set western auto stores hmm western auto stores never heard of that either eh, we'll clean it up take a look we got a little bit need a little phillips bit i'll keep it okay Gotta put all these wrenches back in here. And when I have my garage sale, I'm just gonna keep things in this guy's tub. We'll just mark it down if we have to as we go. This is a long one, boys. I wonder how many people are actually going to make it through this whole thing. Uh, we have this one, and then we have one more tub. I have nowhere to put things again. Okay, this says... Something... I don't know. Fairmont. We'll put that in the keeper pile. Adjustomatic wheel while adjustomatic. It's made in Japan. But is it goofy enough? I mean, it works wherever it is. Yeah, we'll take a look at it. It's got enough stupid weirdness to it that it might be worth something. A weaver. I hate these kind of wrenches. So weird. <clears throat> It says an F, the circle. No, it's an E. No, it's an F on that side. I don't know what this is, though. I mean, I know pliers, but I don't know what uh, brand they are. Can't see anything on those either. This is a Billings. Something Billings. I don't know what the first word is. Worth additional look see. Nope, don't see anything on these either. Hmm. 
What is this, some like cheap ass tin snips or something? <laughs> I don't know what these are. Um, they say Pioneer something. Pioneer Pool Company, Racine, Wisconsin. What, cut a pool liner? We'll keep it. Maybe it's something interesting. It says Dasco. Maybe it's a V. That's D, Dasco. Um, I was gonna say about that this jar opener maybe I think it is it's junk okay. drop forged no name it's old scissors cloths USA Jeez, look at these things. Someone buried them for 50 years. I don't even know what to do about that. These things are old as dirt, it looks like. About to be dirt. Well, too bad we can't see anything on them. I can't say this. Crowder? USA Crowder? I think it says Crowder. Come on. Let's see if we can. There you go. What the hell? My hands are too little. <laughs> I can't even reach it. Uh, let's see. Made in USA. In X U R O N Danbury, Connecticut. Xron Danbury, Connecticut. Micro shear. I mean, they look kind of. Well, we'll keep it long enough to see if there was anything, but it don't don't look like something promising to me. More of the cloths. And there's a lot here. Like a lot, a lot. That's a pretty shot. This is a wild made and I have no idea no wild seven inch wrench it didn't even say anything close to me <laughs> yeah we'll give it a shot there we go these are nice P-E-X-T-O is that what that says You like those? You haven't noticed yet the like piles over here, the I don't like it piles over here. All extension, all trade Taiwan. Go back over here. That says Holton? Fulton. Fulton. Oh man, but look at those things. Not really worth anything at that point, is there? Korea. We're made in Korea. Um, damn, I can't read a thing on there. Kind of, 
not supposed to look like that. Come over here. These pliers have been kind of beat up. Not, not, not impressed with the plier tub. Plier tub, kind of royal. Don't say. Huh. Maybe they'll clean up and be able to see what they say on them. I'll throw a bunch of crap in that evapo rust. Maybe it'll give me a good excuse to do a video on evapo rust. These are cool. Forge Steel USA. Just says Forge Steel USA on either end. Kind of cool looking though. A bunch of different scissors over here. These are bent, man. How good do scissors work like that? Actually, they seem like they work. <laughs> hey, I should have used these to cut those out. It's too late now. This says... I have no idea. Sweden. Sweden and E-S... W I L S T U N A. And another word says E A B E R G. Eberg? Eberg? No, it's not gonna come in clear enough. Worth finding out what that is. These are. Why are they all. have an odd curvature. They have peronies. <laughs> This is going on too long. Hot drop. You want some hot drops from Italy? I'll take a hot drop from Italy. It's kind of cool. It has the pouch. Revlon cuticle scissors. I don't care. Cuticle scissors. China. China. Made in USA. They're Kleins. Many of these probably aren't even worth anything. Even if like pliers like side cutters and stuff. I don't know if anyone would even want it. Exacto. That says Sweden also. It says Germany. And I think the words on top are in German. And this says love. It's supposed to be bent like that? What am I looking at? Oh, Jesus. Can't even open them. I don't want to start with it. Another one of these. Rusted all to hell. Lacrosse? Start throwing the no good ones back in here just because we're out of space. No markings on that. This says, well, they're shot out. Who cares what it says? All right. What else we got here? What is that? Pretty cool. Oh, it's broke. It's cracked on this side. Cool idea, though. Carrying it. Alright, let's put these back. One more tub. Oh, now we have the 
screwdriver tub. Nice wood handle, but no markings. Ace Hardware. Definitely made in USA, so I'll put it off to the side. Tip is a little worn, but not useless. Oh man. Pry bar? Nothing on that. There's a Vulcan. Roscoe? Can I possibly say Roscoe? All the one handle ones I can put together and sells a lot. None of them look particularly in good condition or have any names on them. Cross point number three. I don't know what that means though. I mean you know what I mean. I don't know that brand. Made in USA. Number three, Phillips. Made in USA. Can't make out any kind of brand. I think either way, I'm going to put all the wood handles together. It's a craftsman, you can tell by how it looks, even though you can't read it anywhere in there. Well, that's cool. What is this? Britain, New Britain. New Britain, little flexi shaft guy. I don't know if I should have done that or not. <laughs> there we go. Okay. I'll get mosquitoes out here. I have to wrap this up. Newark. It's bent though. Look at the handle on that thing. <laughs> oh man, these things with the plastic handles just get. All kinds of messed up. This is not a pry bar. Paint everything else on it. Looks like an ace. Oh, Stanley. It's close. Made in USA, but no other marks. <laughs> Things like twisted. Globe Master USA. No marks. Made in USA. Nope, no other brand name though, or no other markings. 
Another Made in USA without any other markings. Wood handle. What the shit was this even ever supposed to be? Joke. It says USA on it. Oh, it's cracked. Well, it's a Sparta. It's cracked. What does that say? Hmm. Does that say Dayton? It's just... I don't know. Made in USA. That's all it says. Look how thick the metal is just for that little nut driver. Man, these screwdrivers are not the best. And there's a proto that bent too. Maybe it's not. But proto's good. Another one of those backo. Maybe I'll have a whole set I can put together. That's three or four we've seen so far. Stanley, but at least it was made in USA. Tips, kind of. Messed up. I don't know if you can tell in there, but it is. Wood handle. Uh, let's see. Marfrey? What the hell is Marfrey? Let's see. Uh, electrical tester. Just thought the other pieces. I don't want to know. Uh, Let's go and grab two. Alright, we gotta start throwing some stuff back in. Sure, I really taped together two busted ass screwdrivers. Okay, what do we got here? No more. Another wood handler. No markings. That guy. That says Frey Company, New York, made in USA. What are we doing here? I don't know, screws. Be full of drugs, money, something. Oh my god. That's so cool. There's a little screwdriver inside of the big screwdriver. Holy shit, that's awesome. Wait, is there another one? Oh, please say there's another one. Please say there's another one. <gasps> oh my god. Holy shit. Oh my god. Oh my. <gasps> it opens too. Oh shit. Oh. <laughs> oh, that's such a genius idea. This one can't open. Okay, that's the end of the line. It's like those Russian nesting dolls. But it's cooler because it's actually useful. That is awesome. Oh, I might have to keep that. Look at that. I mean, that's the best thing in this whole thing. I don't even know if it's worth the most, but that's the coolest. What? That is awesome. I have never seen that. It's not a tight fit. You can hear it kind of... What was that? That was a... Frey Company, New York, USA. Man, clean up that shaft a little bit. And the rest of that thing is in pretty good shape. Of course, this is the only thing exposed. Everything else was in the... That is awesome! That was cool. Stanley, USA, but it looks pretty trashed. We got a wood handle. We got another wood handle. We got... It's vaco, but man. It might clean up. Another Vaco nut driver. 
And another one. I don't know if they're worth anything, really, but at least if I can get a whole set, I got better odds than not. Here's a Vulcan screwdriver. So we'll keep that. And by keep, I mean sell, but not garage sale. Here's a wood handle that you can actually read something on it. Irwin. It's an Irwin one inch. Jeez. Oh, oh god, okay, okay, let's get these things put back together. We make a mess. Alright guys, that's the entire haul. So all that shit for a low, low price of $100. I think I got a good deal. And I got a lot of work cut out for me. Get all this stuff listed. Well, not all. So I'm gonna keep it. I might keep that screwdriver. That thing was awesome. That thing was sweet. Alright guys, thanks for watching. Give the video a like. Subscribe for a nice subscriber. I'll do another video. Maybe clean up the rust on these things and see how that evapo rust works on them. Be a fun project.